No. Um, Sunday Times, Nicholas, and I've just got back from Edinburgh, so it turns out that my comedy shop there wasn't the only thing that's been described as full of poo. You're being too modest. Uh, I hope no viewers are watching or having a late dinner or a kebab after a night of clubbing. No, don't worry, they're, they're all left wing. Listening. <laughs> Good up roll. Scottish beaches have eight times more sewage debris than English ones. So basically, uh, a lot of inappropriate, as if sewage in the seas uh, or on the beaches was not enough. Now we have a lot of inappropriate items, which are essentially uh, sanitary products, wet wipes, uh, condoms. and Naked uh, Scottish people. Uh, <laughs> you name it. Um, so eight times more than England and, and, and Wales. And this association, Marine Conservation Society, has done some beach cleaning in, in the worst case which was in Falkirk, they found an average of 358 items per 100 metres. That is more than, um, basically, three items every metre that you walk dirty around Dirty Falkirk. <laughs> <laughs> you dirty, dirty Falkirkians. In their defence, it's, it's really cruel that the longshore drift means that our condoms are turning up there. If well, you... that's what they're trying to blame. All oh, those <laughs> English condoms coming here to Are we Scotland. that frisky down here? <laughs> Not for a while. I'm yeah. I don't even remember condoms. Anyway, but um, <laughs> they are trying to blame it on people's uh, habits and whatever. And, yes, there is a problem with wet wipes and whatnot. But there is an interesting idea, because it's nationalised up there, the water system, but they don't test their overflows. Mm. So I think it's 3% they test. Mm. Whereas mm. down here, which is uh, private... Um, 91% are tested and they're trying to move to 100%. Now, that doesn't mean that I'm a fan of private water and that money is all those profits are taken out of this country. Um, but it does show that if you are going to have nationalised water, that it should be run properly, which they're not doing in Scotland. You almost obviously. redeemed yourself by going for the private in industry. But <laughs> I just like to keep people you, you guessing. I like to keep the audience there ready. They're getting ready to write a nice comment on social media and then take it back. Do you love how we're being blamed for it, though? The idea that it's flushing things that you can spot. That's the problem. Because if you didn't flush all the tissues and the wet wipes, everything else, all the sewage, you wouldn't notice that it's washed over and you've been for a swim with it because it'd all dissolve. Maybe stop putting sewage in our water. That feels like that might solve it as well. They've also, they've also found more alligators washing up as well. In, in Scotland? Yeah, from then English alligators. Is that what it's it is? It's a very niche reference to anybody who watched 80s <laughs> horror movies. <laughs> there are three turtles as well I've spotted. You need to pay attention. I feel too young. Uh, thank you. <laughs> oh, cheers for making this, yeah, feel old. Um,